What's up, Gorilla Grills Nation? We're here for another Quick Tip Tuesday with Chef Drew. Let's take a couple minutes of your time. So today we're gonna to be making some sour mix. I know in the past we've done a lot of cocktails together. We've done margaritas and so forth with fresh lime juice. It's always nice to have some fresh uh, sour mix floating around your house. You can even freeze it if you want to. It makes all the difference in the world with your drink, that's for sure. Um, it doesn't just have to be a margarita either. Uh, you can do this with lemon juice and make a great Tom Collins. Uh, as far as the lime juice goes, you can make a great from scratch daiquiri. But today we're gonna just do a quick sour mix. All right, very, very simple. We're gonna take our limes, just cut them in half. All right, and then we're gonna take our juicer skin side down or the flesh side down in your juicer we're just going to turn it over to maximize getting as much juice out of there as we can at the very end guys it should look something like that almost like a citrus pancake all right perfect as you can see we've already juiced a couple of these in preparation for this that's plenty of juice there for what we need today and now the next and very important part that we're going to do here is we want to strain this, especially if you're going to hold on to it, get as much of that kind of pulp out of it as that we can, all right? You can strain this into another bowl. All right, guys, so that's some fresh lime juice here. We've got some simple syrup. We're just going to combine these two things. Real, real simple. One cup fresh lime juice. Okay. Half of a cup of simple syrup, all right, guys? When I say half of a cup of simple syrup, I'm using one to one simple syrup. What that means is our ratio is equal parts sugar and water. You can do a two to one or a three to one, meaning you're adding more and more sugar to less and less water. For our purposes for this, we're just using a standard one to one simple syrup, okay? So we're gonna fill this up. Half a cup. One cup citrus, half cup one to one simple syrup. There we go, and we're just gonna whisk it together. And we have some homemade sour mix. It's really that easy. If you have a party or you have a bunch of people over, this is a, always a game changer. People really love the drinks. Again, you can do daiquiris, you can do margaritas, you can take this stuff and make ceviche, you can do this with lemon juice and make Tom Collins, million things to do with it. But if you have extra stuff laying around your house and wanna do this, absolutely go for it. Last but not least, when you use this to order, for example, if you're going to freeze it, pull it out, thaw it out, it always helps if you want to do it to add a little bit of egg white to this. That just gives it that kind of frothiness. If you go to a cool bar and get a great margarita, it's super, super frothy. That's that egg white component. We're not going to do that today. That's just a tip if you want to use it moving forward. You don't have to, but here's our simple, uh, very simple sour mix for you guys for the summertime on the smoke, and we'll see you soon.